hi guys i'm back first and foremost let me say i'm so happy to be back secondly if the lighting and stuff is not that good i'm sorry i still don't know how to work my camera i don't work my camera but i don't know how to really work this lens so that's one thing that i have to work on is trying to figure out like the right settings to use my lens so that I know it just seem like it's just bright because don't nothing like show up like this is far back but like if I put it up here y'all don't see nothing you know what I'm saying it's like a jar so it's like it's too bright of a light or something like that maybe I don't know let me see yeah that's probably was it because you can see it a little bit better now like this is the Taraji Henson line um watch me whip what it's called and it's a hard working whip body cream with vanilla and super rose but y'all didn't come here for that y'all came here to learn more about my update on my driving so i want to give y'all got i want to give you guys that video first and then sis want to give you guys a life update because i have been gone for a minute um, six months, I think, was the last video, five or six months ago. So, Auntie Who, I got my license on May the 12th of 2021, right? And it was an awesome, challenging, terrifying, life-changing experience. Now, in the midst of all of that happening, you know, I was supposed to, like, get a car, save up, do this, do that. But none of that happened because I got fired um, from my job and I didn't get another job until um, until... What did I just say? Let's rewind. Um, oh, I didn't get another job. Girl. <laughs> no, I didn't get another job, y'all. I didn't get another job until March 28th of 2022. So, in all that time, from me getting my license, I got laid off April the 22nd or fire, whatever you want to call it. Um, I lost my position and then I got unemployment and I got unemployment probably until like November or so like they told me I had to come back in December and all that I'm just like I've been working at a company for five years how do I not have unemployment and he was like well it's not bad how long you've been working it's pretty much the months and it was like a lot of red tape and a lot of politics about it. It wasn't the same way as it was like when I was younger and you got unemployment. So, anywho, I sit up there and I went through that, right? I went through that. And I got a new job, March the 28th. So, during that time, I was getting unemployment. Unemployment only pay you half of your wages. So, I didn't save up for a car. And now, during that time, I did go... Um, I drove a couple of times um, in other people's cars, but I still, I don't feel comfortable driving other people's cars because I'm a new driver, and I feel like if I'm going to crash something or hit something or do something, I want to be responsible for it in my own vehicle, and I know to somebody that might sound crazy, but it's my truth, like, the one thing I hate is messing up someone else's stuff. My stuff will eventually be replaced. But messing up somebody else stuff, I don't like that. So, I decided to um, still look for cars and things like that. I was inquiring. And then, you know, not having money, credit score drops, things happen. So, it was just like, okay, I have to rebuild myself and I'm still in that process of rebuilding a lot of things so i got a job march the 28th 
it was a job that I got because I needed work. It's not a job that, and it seemed like it had like good opportunities, guys. But we'll talk about that another day. But anywho, I got that job, and once I got that job, I felt like, hey, I work in like um, early childhood education field. And all my life, everyone has been telling me, like, you should be a teacher. You're so good with kids. Kids love you. This, that, and other. And I'm like, you know what? You got your license. You've done some things. You've built a, you've um, started your YouTube. You've done some things. So, hey, girl, embark on that journey. But as I've been working, I still haven't saved up for a car yet. But let me tell you guys, um... If you can, like, I hope whoever, like, if you get your license, please do not be down on yourself about getting a car. Please don't. Because the one thing that you don't want to do is take the progress from your goal that you achieved. You just write down your goal of when you're going to get a car and keep trying to achieve that goal. But please do not down yourself. Do not be mad at yourself. Do not be mad at the world or God because God hears all of our prayers. God hears like if you believe in the higher power, I believe in the power of Jesus Christ. But if you believe in the higher power and you have a spiritual connection of faith, just keep your faith in your situation because you just never know. Like I'm never gonna act like I don't sit around sometimes and be like, Man, I want a car. I want to drive because I do because it's so much independence and to all my subscribers who have got a car after you got your license congratulations to you because you've done two things that I know you wanted to do probably for a long long time so congratulations to you but no I haven't got a car guys but I was still trying to drive and you know, if somebody say, give me hand will to do something, I try. Except for my boyfriend car. Because, see, I don't like how fast that car accelerates. So, I'm going to be like, mm. Mm-mm. But, he always be trying to encourage me to drive. And I just want you guys to know, like, it's a goal in everything you do. And when you reach your goal, you reach your goal. Don't compare... Oh, my cousin, when he got his license or she got her license, they got a car three days after. Or they, somebody else paid. You know, you would love for somebody else to put a car in and ain't nothing for you. And you try to keep up the payments. But what if something happened? That's what I'm saying. Like, I just want to be able to do things all by myself. All for myself. I know I can't do everything by myself. But one thing I do know is that I'm not giving up. Like, I have a license now. So... I ain't giving that up. I'm not going to turn around and give nobody back what I worked hard for. Like, I, I worked for that license. When I tell y'all I was up, I studied, I, you would think that I was in college for driving. <laughs> like, seriously, like, I ate and breathed that trying to learn and trying to figure it out and that's another thing like i have to do too like you have to keep refreshing yourself while you're not driving because you're not as familiar with everything that's going on in the streets but i just want everybody to know that i'm still proud of myself i'm still thankful i'm still thinking about my next move i still got a goal for a car i still believe that i can do this because i can you can too. There is nothing that can stop you but you. And I'm going to have a vehicle. And I can't wait y'all to do car vlogs. Like when I be seeing people going different places now. I already told y'all. I don't know about like. What's that place? The supermarkets and stuff. I'm not sure about that. Because I don't like grocery shopping number one. But it just be a lot of people that just be looking. Like. This is a lifestyle now. This is people real life jobs. Like they livelihood. Like what are you looking at? But. I do want to be able. And no I will be able to soon. I'm not going to give up on my goal. I know God hears my prayers. And he knows the things. In which I want to do and can do. And I just relinquish. All my fears to him. Like of owning a vehicle. You know so. I'm ready. 
and I cannot wait y'all but yes um like I said um and still when I was driving y'all I was still nervous I never act like I wasn't because you're still new to that particular thing and I still think people who drive whether they've been driving two days or 20 years you got to drive for everybody else and you still get nervous because you just don't know who's on the other side of a wheel, who's driving, what they're doing, and what the heck is going on. It could be a driver that's drunk. It could be this. It could be a driver that they stole a car. They're trying to do a, a, um, a getaway. Uh, like, you don't know. And so my whole thing is, like, just don't give up on yourself because once you start giving up on you you making the biggest mistake possible and don't beat up on yourself if you know that you are really here and you really want this go and you really send back like yeah i'm here i know i want to drive i know i want a car i know i've been paying my credit card bill i know this that and the other like do it please do it Another thing that I want y'all to know is that all cars don't drive the same. <laughs> I don't care if they even the same make and model. Like all cars don't drive the same. They could if they especially different years of cars that same make and model. But I'm sorry, all cars don't drive the same. You have to literally take that with a grain of salt and be like, you know what? This car don't drive like this car or this don't do this like this. And it's okay, y'all. Like, we have to know that things are okay in our lives. And not be trying to rectify the situation with being hard on ourselves. So, I'm okay with being uncomfortable in a forward focus but being comfortable in a Kia Optima or vice versa. I'm okay with that. So don't get discouraged or down on that either because people will tell you like everything don't drive the same because you know how to drive. Just like every bike don't ride the same. Every pair of skates don't skate the same. Like things are different just like us. Also when it comes down to driving guys please understand that Driving is a luxury and a privilege to me. Like, just because you on this earth don't mean that you deserve to drive. No. If you're not following the rules of the road, if you're not doing what you're supposed to do behind that wheel, why are you behind it? All that drinking and getting drunk and smoking and this and that, like, you can do that. But let's do it responsibly because... It's so many people that's losing their family members to people that are not coherent because of alcohol or drugs while they're driving. And so I just want you guys to know that driving is a real privilege. And if you're able to do it, like, please don't let it get taken away for nothing. What else? Um, I think in this day and time, Uber is too high. And I'm not an Uber driver, so I might not be saying that right. But I feel like the Ubers are too high Um, when it comes down to you paying for the ride. Because a lot of Uber drivers are not getting that money. Uber is taking most of the money and giving the drivers the crumbs. And it's like... Oh, excuse me. And it's like, these people are risking their lives every day. Like in my city, Uber drivers were getting, you know, the K word and robbed and all of that. And it's like, uh uh. -huh. So, that's just another thing when it comes down to certain things. Like, we cannot take that for granted. Um, because again, Ubers are getting high and you know, you have to really know, you definitely have to know that if you are driving 
riding an Uber like you do. Like for me, riding an Uber is so expensive. Like I be like, I really wish I had a car. But I'm thankful for Uber. But I really think that the drivers go through a lot and should be paid more out of what we pay to go where we're going. Um, let me see what else can I say about driving. Driving has been one of the most beautiful experiences that I've experienced when I got my license. And I just want you guys to keep that energy. If we keep the energy, I know it starts to die down the longer you don't have a car, the longer you're not driving, but work on that energy. I've been like, yes, I got my license. Yes, I'm out here. Yes, soon I'm going to be out here in these streets cruising or whatever. So... I just want y'all to know those things. Um, if anybody have any questions that I didn't say or you know I didn't sum up in this video, please feel free to write on this video. But I don't have a car yet, so I still got a lot of work to do when it comes down to driving myself around still. And I can't wait, y'all. I cannot wait. When I get my keys to my car. Y'all going to be some of the first to know. Y'all lie. Because it's been a journey and y'all been waiting for an update for over a year. But it's just like I got. It's so much stuff. I got. I dived and jumped and swam and put myself in so much stuff for work and life. Being in a relationship and you know. All of that, it take a toll on you. And you be tired, like, y'all. I just feel like driving has taught me so many things. But what it didn't teach me was to give up. Don't give up on yourself, please. Don't give up on your journey. God allows things to happen for a reason. It's the reason why you're not driving. It's the reason why you don't have a car yet. But you got your license. You did the first step. And all you have to keep saying to yourself is I did the first step. God got me to the next step. And that's what I'm saying. God got me to the next step. You know the next step is I want a car. Lord, I be pressed times like somebody could just give me a hand-me-down car. I remember um that happened before to a close friend of mine. Like her first car was given to her. You know, so God will bless you. You just have to know how to bless you and trust God and understand that in due time you did the first thing, second, third. Now if you procrastinate on your own, get up. Get you that car. You can do it. But if circumstance got you by the collar, ain't nothing you could do about that. But pray and work hard to get out of that circumstance. But that's my time, guys. I'm going to come back soon with my life update. I'm going to do my life update today. I'm going to pretty much be looking just like this. We have all of this or whatever. But I definitely wanted to get my car update out there for you guys and let you know that no I haven't gotten a car yet but when I do y'all I can't wait to pick up my camera I can't wait to post it I can't wait do you hear me I can't wait I'll talk to you guys later have a good night deuces